There is a potential side effect to the COVID vaccine that you may not have heard of. It can cause swelling in the face in people who have had certain cosmetic procedures. But CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez says it is treatable. How you doing, okay? Yeah, great. Right. Facial fillers are one of the most common cosmetic procedures in the U.S. More than two and a half million people had them injected in 2019 to plump up lips, fill in skin folds and wrinkles, and replace lost facial volume due to aging. But some folks who've had a COVID vaccine and had facial fillers in the past are developing an unusual and rare side effect. So within the 24 hours, I did have a little bit of a slight reaction, a little bit of swelling on my lips and my cheeks were, is where I actually had my injections done. Turns out doctors have known of this reaction to fillers, not Botox, but it is rare. Only three cases out of more than 15,000 participants in the Moderna vaccine trial. And it's not just a COVID vaccine that can trigger the swelling. You can have um, dermal filler swelling with any type of vaccination, whether you're getting a flu vaccination, a shingles vaccination, you can have dermal filler swelling. If you have any issues, just give me a call. Patients like, like Phyllis Crystal pills, had some concerns, but was reassured by the rarity of the reaction and that it's temporary and readily treatable. Beautiful. It's treatable with basic anti-inflammatory such as ibuprofen. You can treat it with an antihistamine such as Benadryl, or if the facial swelling is quite severe, which that's very not likely the case, you can have your physician write for um, a dose of oral steroids such as prednisone. Christina's swelling went away in eight hours after taking ibuprofen. Right now, it's not known which vaccines might trigger the swelling or with what type of filler, but the advice is consistent in the medical community. You should not forego a potentially life-saving vaccine for fear of a temporary treatable swelling. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.